Hello and welcome to a new Elite Let's Play Poorly. This is the game that started it all. I wanted to uh, put out some content for Elite because there really wasn't any. And then I made the channel and then things just kind of happened and I couldn't stop myself and I kept on going. Well, uh, here we are again. It's been a little while since we've done Elite. I have kind of forgotten most of it. I think it's I haven't actually played it off screen in a in a long while. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, do a modded playthrough. Uh, I prefer the modded version so much more than vanilla. Uh, just even just the visuals are just so much better. So we're gonna go ahead and look at uh, the expansion packs that I have installed. I'm just gonna go through this fairly briefly. Uh, we've got a whole bunch of activities that we can do that are added in. Ambiance, which is mostly going to be visual and audio stuff. Uh, as you can see here, planet names and so on. Things that we can dock to, different kinds of equipment. And then the Vimana HUD and some MFDs, the multifunction displays that we're going to be using. New mechanics, big ships, escort formations, things like that. Uh, escape pods or more escape cup pods, new kinds of cargo, and then some miscellaneous stuff, and then a, some missions. We never really did too many missions in the first playthroughs that I did. Hopefully we'll get into that more. I don't know. Uh, I'm, I'm very bad at this game. I mostly just tootle around and sell stuff, so, you know, uh, hopefully we'll be able to push out some more. And then retextures, new ships added in, a lot some uh, updates to the way the systems work, new weapons, and so on. In addition, we also have uh, mods that are not in the expansion uh, manager. We've got a uh, furball mod, which lets, which has NPCs fighting close combat together, like off in the distance a lot. And then my own mod, uh, which is the contextual jukebox, which puts music into the game. Not this music. This music is part of the BGS uh, mod, I believe. But the music inside the game uh, that we'll, you'll see is music that I have selected from a musician, a composer named Eric Matias, who provides his music free of charge uh, and for for free use. So I put together a mod that changes the music based on where you are, what you're doing, and so on. So let's go ahead and start a new commander. We could do a normal start, which starts us with basic bog standard stuff, but we don't end up with the fuel injectors, which makes the starting stuff incredibly painful. So what we're going to do is a fast track start. We're going to have 100 credits at Lave Station with the Cobra Mark III. We're going to have a mining laser, fuel scoops, and which space fuel injectors. Uh, that's, that's the main thing we want. We want the uh, fuel injectors. Right. Go in. Okay, the Galactic Almanac. And a uh, situation has occurred. Oh, the, the Stellar Serpents creatures. Okay. First thing I want to do is go in here to the interfaces and pick my Vimana HUD with the 12 MFDs. There we go. First thing. First thing. Now, we don't have a lot of money. So let's go to the market and see. Differential prices, this is uh, a lot of what we want. Uh, 17 tons for sale. I've got a 20 ton hold. Textiles have the best differential. And I don't remember kind of exactly what the uh, the patterns are for who needs what, but I think it's fairly straightforward. But we'll we'll kind of have to get there. So let's uh, let's start with some textiles, maybe. So, uh, let's do ten. That's best we can do. I don't want to waste all. I don't want to spend all of my money. That would be ridiculous. Okay. Let's take a look at our galactic chart. So we're here in Lave. And we want, let's 
Let's see. Why do I see? I want the long range chart. Where do we see the types? I think. No. There it is. That's what I want. Okay. So we are in, yes, an agricultural, uh, I think this is anarchy. No, this is dictatorship. Level five. And we need to go sell this stuff. Because it's textiles, we probably should go and sell it here. That would be the nearest plot. Oh, no, this would be even better over here. Zomps, right? Uh, because that is an average industrial. They don't really have textiles, I'm guessing. So we need to go to Zounce and... Let's see. How do I... Oh, I can't remember how to select that. Guess we've got to launch. We'll see what happens. Okay, so I am using my Touch Portal app on my iPad to do most of my ship functions now. Um, turn these off because we don't need them just yet. Because I will never remember what's on my throttle. That's 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 going to be a problem. So, okay. Galactic chart. I select a destination. I don't remember how to do that. It's planetary data. Hmm. I don't quite remember how this works. Oh, it's working now. Okay. Never mind. I didn't have to worry about it. It just kind of does it automatically. I had remembered that I needed to select it or something, but I guess I don't. I, I think that might be something with uh, one of the modules that you can buy, so. If I remember right, you can set uh, paths. Oh, yeah, the, the, the green cross is where you're located. That's right. Okay. Now, I don't currently have any ability to... Uh, to see my... Uh, to see, to see the mass locks. So I'm going to have to go find... Uh, I'm going to have to find the, that equipment. So let me uh, go ahead and turn on my Taurus drop. Ah, oh, I'm mass locked as it is. Okay, that's right. Fuel injectors. Let's go. There we go. Taurus drive is up. Ooh, there's a space critter. Oh, shit. Okay, come on now. What is that? Is that a space critter? Uh, doesn't have it there, okay. We need to get out of out of this zone. There's just too much stuff flying around. There we go. Taurus drive on. So yeah, for games like this where you've got a lot of complex buttons and things that you don't always use all the time, I do recommend something like Touch Portal. It's very handy. Who are you? Oh, that's some kind of a... Hmm. Not sure what that is. Okay, I could refuel at... 
There. Okay, let's do that because I'm down to one, uh, 1.0 in fuel. Well, as I'm getting used to the game again and I don't have all the equipment that I need, it is really important that I not get stranded. Got my got my thing is super wide. Well, <laughs> what's up, fun start? We're gonna try it again. Fast track start. This time we'll we'll know what we're doing. We'll be well, <laughs> yeah. I say that now. Back to the interfaces, select the HUD, go to the market, get the textiles, launch. Oh, I don't have a location yet. Uh, okay. There we go. I don't have a compass or anything yet, so I can't track the things that I'm looking for, but I, uh, like the, the stations, I know, I'm pretty sure that's it right there in front of me. So let's, uh, okay, let's get our Taurus on. Let's see if we can find a way around any of this other stuff. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Is he up here? Is that him? That might not actually be it. Oh, that's, that is the fuel station. Okay. Let's try this again. not crash, please. We're gonna get fuel. There it is. Fuel transfer underway, that's what we need. It's not very expensive, only costs like three credits or what have you. Um, oh, and that's right, I do have to remember to turn on the auto fueling in stations so I don't forget. But this is a more fun way to do it, honestly. These little gas stations are pretty cool. Okay, fuel tanks are full, let's get on going. And Taurus up. There we go. There's the station right there. Once we 
get close enough, it'll it'll give us a track. There it is. Boogie Nights! Let's get a docking request. Oh no! I cannot dock here! That's right, because it's fucking corporate. Oh, these bastards. Well, we're gonna get a fine if we do this. We gotta do it anyway. They won't like it. Please clear the docking area. Yeah, that's all right. We're gonna come in here, gonna cash the fine. But we don't have a lot of money. Fine, 0.9 credits. Yeah. Okay, so this is the collector. Uh, currently pestering his neighbor. What, where's this collector? Well, let's see. Can't tell you for sure. Okay, to do, find the rich spaceship collector. So we start out with our manifest. Uh, we have a mission. Oh, actually, we have a bunch of missions. Well, not missions that are specific, but... So, find the rich spaceship collector. The LeVay and UPS branch rates your courier reputation is average. Use the tow bar, a tow bar, to get reputation by salvaging derelict ships. Never really done that. I um, have to buy one of those at, some, at that point. Bounty hunters. We're going to have to try to learn how to do some fighting, some proper combat. So, let's go ahead and come here. Ah, yeah, that's a decent price. Yeah, more than double what we started with. Excellent. What's the best rate here? That's going to be computers. That's probably as much as I should do. Don't want to waste all my money. Okay, so let's see. There's bulletin board, there's parcel contract deliveries. Holy shit, that's probably... These are probably really far away, right? Videos of ice tennis. I like that. Asambi and Relays. Let's see. Uh, let's look at our galactic chart. Do I know anything? I don't know anything about anything anywhere. So that's a problem, right? I don't know where any of this crap is. I only know these places. So we're not going to be able to do any of that... Uh, any of these contract services did parcel deliveries for a little bit. Um, all right. Okay. So this is bulletin board. Ooh, this is a new feature from the new things. Okay. Just gonna pass new transport. We can't transport passengers because we don't have uh, berths. Okay. Uh, what is this here? Interesting. This is uh, telling us about the Zounce system. Eight worlds, planets, gas giants, and moons. Yeah, that's cool. This is where all of the... Ah, okay. This is super useful. I, did, I don't remember having this before. I think, I think this is updated since the last time I played. So uh, it's telling us where we can find uh, different stations in this system. So Boogie Nights buoy is where we kind of connect to to get into the station here. There's the fuel station. There's a Newit station before the fall. Don't know anything about that. Uh, oh, interesting. Page two. Yeah, there's a lot and there's orbiters. Oh wow, there's so much. See, this is the this is the thing I like about Elite. Unlike Elite Dangerous, Elite is jam-packed or can be jam-packed with mods jam-packed with with stuff uh now there's they're fairly shallow like we'll grant that you know there's not too much that, interesting that you can do on them other than buy and sell and things like that but they're there they're they're out there and you can get to them relatively quickly uh it's it's very nice okay 
Do we have any settings that we want to do here? Uh, procedural name generation mode on or off, background. Oh, I see. Okay, so this is... Uh, This is just to do different. Yeah, but we're going to leave these off because I think they're already preset by one of the other mods. So. Ghost ship sighted. Interesting. Okay. Horn blue, hor blue bird. Haha. <laughs> uh, right. There we go. Interesting. Ah, oh, commodity markets of Zounce. So the main station that we're on right now, Newit Station, the Surf Station, the Kyoto Solar. Oh, interesting. If I went to Kyoto Solar, I could buy textiles and then sell them at the main station, but they only have five, six available, so it won't really help me too much. Well, it might be worth doing if I can find it. I, I, I won't really be able to find it until until I have the compass, so... We're gonna we're gonna leave that be. No system history that we have yet. Yeah, and this is the in-system distances. System data sheet. Yeah, okay. This is uh this is all different ways of getting the same kind of information. Raven mission, which we don't have yet. Station docking counts. Explorers Club. Huh. Interesting. Wow, that's a lot of... This is so cool. So now there's basically achievements, right? These aren't, I mean, not really achievements, but they're they are goals that we can work towards. Ah, I love it. Okay. So, yeah, let's launch. We need to go find a... Uh, yeah, well, well I, guess, I guess we could just use... But you could just go back to to Lave and sell the computers down there. I think that would be the way to go. I had forgotten how much I love this game. Uh, I was worried that I'd gotten burned out from playing it as much as I did before. Uh, turns out, no. Turns out I just needed to take a little pause, and then everything else is hunky-dory again. Oh, fuel station is right behind me. Let's do it. Is that it? No, that's it right there. I forgot to set up my uh, auto fueling. did crash. What the heck? Let's not do that. Oh. It's just, yeah, oh, it's not a place that I land on. It's just a satellite. Oh, that's fucking weird. How about we don't crash into that, though? Where is it? Is that it? Yeah. Oh, 
Okay, so I can just kind of fly up alongside it, I guess. I don't go in. Oh, that's cool. It's a different if it's a different thing. The other one was like a little dock, but this one was just a satellite. Got to say this is a much more fun way of collect, of getting fuel than by buying it at the stations. Taurus up. Head towards the planet. Mass locked. Ah, fuck. Get out of here. Come on, come on, come on. I ain't got the guns for this. something right there ahead of me. I don't think that's the station. I think that might be a big ship of some sort. Let's find out. Well, we've got mass locks here. Taurus. Yeah, that's something else. That's not my station. Oh, but my station is over here. There it is. I gotta wait till they get, yeah, 25 kilometers, that's it. Okay. What? Oh, I'm still refused, okay. Different, different, uh, different stations, different problem, okay. Well, we're just gonna do it again, anyway. Take the take the the L. Take the hit. They don't really charge you very much. It's a proportion. It's a percentage of your money, <laughs> and I ain't got no money. I might have to get some visas at some point to do this legitimately. Two point two. Okay. Go to the market. Okay, that's okay. We'll sell those. 310 now. I could buy a save in flight, uh, which... Let's do that. Allows me to save in flight, as it says. Got options here. Uh, let's save the command. No, do I save yet? Let's hang on. I do have the saving flight mod module installed now. Oh, I do have a pulse laser and the mining laser on the app. Okay. Now there is a way to. Hmm. Auto fuel, right? I can't remember what that is. Oh, it doesn't matter. Got ships for sale. Let's see. Oh, 
I cannot remember how to fuel, but maybe I don't need to. Maybe I can just use the, the fuel guys again in the future. Fuel satellites and, and so forth. Hopefully someone will remind me how to do that. <laughs> It's not in here. Uh, that's fine. Now, for Embassy District, this is where I can get citizenship, I can get visa, and it's only, it's really cheap, but if I have enough money, if I have too much money, it will cost me more to just kind of uh, shoot my way in rather than taking the visa. So, we'll probably take the visa. Yeah, let's take the, fee the visa, and then we're going to go ahead and go to the market. And uh, the textile prices aren't great right now. We could do fresh water. Yeah, let's fill up in fresh water and then we'll go and sell it back there. But we're at 32 minutes almost, so I'm going to go ahead and save the game. And we're going to save this as Archibus, right? And I'm also going to save my backup. Best practices, you know. And that's going to do it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.